Hey everybody, I want to answer some more questions today. I'm hoping to make this a weekly thing, so we'll see how it goes. So, all right, the first question this week is from Nathan. Nathan, you say, I still have loads and loads of acne marks slash scars. What do I do to get rid of these marks and scars? And Lara, um, you also asked a similar question. Um, as far as scars go, scars are more or less permanent. You can do some scar revision. Um, to find out more about that, go ahead and click on the Acne Info dropdown, and you can uh, learn more about scars there. And as far as red marks, I'm going to refer you to another dropdown, which is the Acne Info. And then you go down to More Info and Ethnic Skin. When you get to that page, there's a Hyperpigmentation tab, and that talks all about these red marks and what to do about them. Just in brief, um, you pretty much just have to um, wait for them to fade. There's nothing that I know of that's a miracle at getting rid of these red marks. The best thing that you can do is to prevent acne in the first place so that you don't get these red marks. Um, red marks themselves are not scars and they will go away. So don't freak out. If you just have some red marks, they will go away. Concentrate on clearing up your skin so that you don't create more red marks in the future. All right, we've got Pat. Pat, you ask, Dan, why doesn't my AHA sting? I don't feel anything when I put it on. Well, I just think you're lucky. <laughs> um, you must not have sensitive skin. Um, the AHA is 10% AHA and it's pretty darn powerful. So I've heard from a few people that it doesn't sting. Fantastic. Um, you should still be getting um, the results that you want from it. If you're not getting the results you want from it, go ahead and email me and let me know that. Um, but if you're getting the results, just count yourself lucky. <laughs> Wally, you ask, hey Dan, you never commented on your switch of the regimen. Remember, you were only doing AHA in the morning with no BP because you wanted to wear colored shirts again. <laughs> um, I'm sorry, I, I, I thought I did comment on it, but maybe I didn't. Um, the, it didn't work, in, in short, again. So um, I had to go back to doing BP twice a day. I was really hoping that using AHA in the morning was gonna be good enough for me. But as for most people that I've ever coached um, through the regimen, you gotta do BP twice a day. Um, I thought maybe I was growing out of acne enough to be able to use AHA in the morning, but alas, I still have to use um, BP twice a day. And finally, Richard, you ask, Dan, how about creating an app for the iPhone? Read my mind. <laughs> um, I would love to create an app for the iPhone. If there's anybody out there who knows how to program for the iPhone and wants to um, volunteer your time a little bit, I would love to do an app teaching people how to do the regimen. I would also love to do just a fun application um, that people can learn about the regimen through just having some fun on the iPhone. So really good idea. I'd love to do it. Any volunteers? <laughs> Let me know. Um, okay, that's it for today, and I will see you guys tomorrow.